In today's video, I'll be showing you my post relax I watch day routine. So if you're interested in knowing how I really shed in, retain strength, and the long run within my hair length, then keep watching. So this is the current state of my hair. My hair is currently three weeks post to relaxer, and I'm just gonna start off by ensuring that my hair is properly saturated. I don't know about you, but my hair is one of those hair types that you see that in order for the hair to actually get into the scalp, you have to go multiple times with water because you might think it's wet enough or in the next few seconds, it's back to being afro looking. So now that I ensure that my hair is properly wet, I'm going to begin in with my mega good stimulating shampoo. And this is the consistency that we have. On first attempt, you will see that my hair is not lathering enough and that's because it has build up of hair products, hair cream, hair gel and all of those things and as well as dandruff and dirt that I might have accumulated in this three weeks. So I'm starting off by showing that the edges of my hair is properly having the shampoo because these are the places where I normally put my gel that is when I want to get my hair and sleep on so if those areas are good I'm fine as you can see I'm checking to see the level of dirt I've accumulated so after doing this the first time I'm just going to wash it off you would notice that if your hair is so dirty that's if you delayed with your wash day you have to do this more than once that's because you have to ensure that the shampoo has really gotten into your scalp and got rid of any dirt or dandruff that you might be having. So I'm going about this again and at this point, one might think, okay, my hair is showing that it's a bit clean, but this is just totally personalized up to you. I like to go over this more than twice because I like my hair to be properly lathered in the shampoo. So at this point, my hair is a bit cleaner and we're just rinsing all this off to ensure that I am having the best state of my hair at this junction. So I'm just gonna keep quiet right now and just let you enjoy this piece of me washing my hair and you enjoying the length of hair that I have so far. Okay, so right now I'm washing my hair for the third time and if you go back in a few seconds ago, you see that my hair was not this laddered as it is right now. So when it gets to this point, I am then fully convinced that my hair is properly clean and at the point of me washing it the third time i was feeling a bit clean now when it comes to my hair because i didn't have any itchiness and when i'm doing this i do not rest i ensure that my fingers are going straight into my scalp and it might look like i'm playing fighting a battle but it's not so after washing my hair up then it's time for my conditioner i'm making use of mega good conditioner and i have always loved how this help to detangle my hair and make my hair a bit softer so one thing about this routine in case you've not noticed is that i'm not going with any comb if you watch any of my videos whereby i'm washing my hair in the shower i might have gone with, with a comb multiple times but i have learned that we relax hair your your hair is then your hair has more tendencies of breaking when it's wet and if you're going to comb, your comb just going to be tugging on your hair and making it break and since we're trying to achieve less breakage and less shedding, using my hands I've just ensured that I get less hair being broken and I still get the same result at the end of the day so you have to be gentle with your hair, just treat it like a human being and as you can see right now I'm trying to get out the hair that I have lost and this is all that was lost in this entire hair process because it's amazing it's really amazing so you want to treat your hair how you like to be treated you don't want someone to bring the comb onto your life so treat your hair how you want to be treated and this is still me washing up the conditioner that i applied on my hair i like to separate my hair into two not so equal parts to ensure that the conditioner is getting into every area and when I'm washing it off at the same time, I'm using my hand to also detangle it as I go in along the way. So straight out of the shower, this is how we are looking and we are loving how we are feeling. Going straight deep into my mega good deep conditioner, it's at a breakage, like I'm not playing with this breakage issue. So while going in with this product, firstly, I like to partition my hair into sections and hold them securely. I like to do this so that 
I can be sure that I'm getting the right amount of product onto each section of my hair and each section and no section rather is left out okay so with this product it provides an ultra protective blend of natural oils and conditioning protein that help to strengthen your hair providing you with stronger healthier looking hair it contains products that help to rebuild your natural hair strength and protect against styling stresses and restore your softness and your natural shine so this is best applied when your hair is still damp straight after you've left the bathroom applying your shampoo and conditioner and you can apply this as well then go in with a plastic bag or a dryer but i'm letting my hair air dry for this moment so i'm just applying this properly liberally onto every section of my hair i want to apply it generously as well so you don't want to be mind seeing the product to take us we want to have that shine at the end of the day so that is what we are going to do so right now i'm just going to keep quiet and watch you guys watching me do this to my hair So after applying the product on my hair enough to my satisfaction, I like to use my fingers to also detangle it. Like I said, going in with a comb on a wet relaxed hair just causes breakage. I learned this the hard way, so I wouldn't want you guys to go through the same thing that I went through. So you want to use your fingers gently onto your hair. At this point, your hair is a bit moisturized. From applying deep conditioner that contains protein mask, so you it's not going to, it's not going to be as difficult as you think it might be before you apply this product. Okay, so you just want to take your time and apply this. So right now I'm going to let my hair air dry. I like to let my hair air dry like about 80% because if I go in straight with the blow dryer, it just causes heat onto my hair and just end up getting shabby and I don't like it so when my hair has a dried about 80% I then go in with the mega growth oil and this is because I'm going to go in with the form of heat later on with the blow dryer so if you know that your hair is going to end up in any form of heat be it hair straightening or blow drying of your hair you want to do this and it contains protein mask as well it contains shea butter so you can be rest assured that you're going to be having a healthy looking hair that's also protected from heat damage and if you're prone to having dandruff if you normally have like a dry scalp on a daily basis you can go in with this when your hair is still dry onto your scalp to protect and prevent dandruff buildup. okay So alongside with the mega good oil i go in with my anti-dandruff treatment and this is my therapy for dandruff because ever since i started using this product i haven't had any issue with dandruff and this was the first mega good product that i tried on newly i haven't used it before i didn't want to have a kid so i got onto it and i'm like okay let's see if it's going to work and you guys if you're not getting any other thing from this video ensure that you get this anti-dandruff treatment because if you're someone like me that suffered from dandruff as a child as a teenager you just want to have this product okay because you cannot sleep on this it contains active clipazole system to treat your dandruff from its roots by releasing the growth of dandruff causing 
fungus. It is enriched with nourishing coconut oil, refreshing menthol. So when you apply it, you have that damato feeling. I don't know how many of you use damato as a kid, but it has that menthol feeling that you just experience once again, and it contains tea tree oil to protect your hair as well. It's best used on your scalp regularly so i even go on with this product on days when i'm not washing my hair maybe i have cornrows on apply that bit to my scalp but for right now i'm going to go in with this alongside with the good oil to just make my hair look healthier and protect my hair from scalp because if your scalp is not dry then there's no room for dandruff to grow so i apply the dandruff treatment onto my scalp then go in with the good oil for my actual hair from the root of my hair to the tip of my hair and this just helps to collectively reduce dandruff and reduce visible flakes so even if you have your hair done and you're seeing that you're having flakes on your hair yeah you can also go in with these two guys to eliminate those flakes and it also gives me a very very good ground for me to have a stronger looking undamaged relaxed hair i have tried these guys personally several times this is my holy grail and i will not want to sleep on this guy so applying the growth or generously like i said before and then applying the dandruff treatment onto my scalp these are my dandruff solutions on my relaxed hair for a girl living in a very hot country in lagos nigeria so after, so after applying all this product, it's advisable for you to use a plastic cap or sit under a dryer for about 10 to 15 minutes for deep penetrating. Yeah, so I'm not using a comb at this moment. I just want to ensure that the products I use have gotten deep penetration onto my actual hair. I don't want to just sit in there. I want to do this work. So after using that, I'm going to go in with my daily live in street now and the most second popular challenge of relaxed hair is having split ends and breakage okay so this is going to help you to reduce your breakage and your split ends and once you apply this generously onto your hair i then go in with my comb and then my blow dryer so you see that as i'm combing my hair my hair is not shedding any longer like compared to how it normally shed it's not shedding any longer and just gives me that natural shine you can see how my hair is glowing so it's at this point then i go in on my comb to straighten my hair at the same time so guys this is the finished look this is the final look that we've gotten and i love it i love it so so much but at the same time i like to just let my hair breathe and let my hair just relax and it just looks good this is natural shine there's no freeze there's no breakage thank you guys for watching bye